Hey guys, what's up? Toba Loco here, and today we are back with the Subscriber World Cup. It's September already, can you believe it? We've basically been indoors for basically the whole year. Um, I hope you're all doing well. I just wanted to say, um, starting off, thank you for 1,300 subscribers. I hope we can push that to 1,350, 1, or maybe 100, no, 1,400. What am I saying? I don't even know what I'm saying right now. Um, so yeah, I wanted to get that out of the way. Um, so thank you. Um, second thing is that we got really good entries this month, really good ones. Um, next month, I'm planning to do two. So the first subscriber world cup for October will be on the 6th of October or around that time because I'm on holiday that time so I can actually do it. Um, that means that um, you can put any nation you want and then on the 31st or the 30th of October depending on uh, if I can get out early, we'll do the Halloween special, which obviously is the one star, two star, and maybe three star teams. Uh, maybe two and a half is the limit, maybe. But uh, for the next one, you can have anybody you want, just like this one. But I, the Halloween special, just a heads up, that it's only one star or two star teams only. Okay, now now I've got that out of the way, let's get the names out of the way. Let's see who got in. Turkey is Kuala Koinu. I'm sorry if I butcher your names. Portugal, Lewis Pen Uh Northern Ireland, Wasabi, 1982-1. Russia, Agelos Galaris. Um, Fiji, Variety Channel. Curacao, That Boy Jan. Uh, Scotland, Isaac Flores Jr. Chad is Goose Pasho. Um, and Group C, we've got Greece, which is Petros, 1892. We have Ghana, Josh Thomas. Germany, double entry, Nando Namath and Hugh Haney. Canada, Stefan Juro. Uh, the UAE in Group D is represented by Eritra Santra. Uh, Paraguay's Beastly N64. Montenegro is Nicholas Jakobsen. And Spain is not your average gaming kid. Um, e, um, Australia, Gregory Byrne, as usual, he always picks that team. <laughs> Romania, me plays. USA is a double entry between Alan Smith and Michael Elu. And Colombia is also a double entry with John Doe and Led's gameplay. Group F, we have Argentina, which is a double entry, it's uh, double A and uh, Orange Overcast. Uh, Netherlands is Low Limewire, Nigeria is Naja Football, and the Uruguay is the person who has that the name that I can't pronounce, but their picture is basically just like I, I think it's like a girl with some shades on or something. Yeah, that person. You know who you are. <laughs> Group G, Sierra Leone is Matthew Murphy, Kenya is Wasteland Wanderer, Mali is Carlos Tapia, New Zealand is Cillian Burke. Uh, H, Poland is, this is a really hard name, Majeski, is that right? Kuzak? I don't know, I don't know, I'm really sorry. I'm, the guy with the Real Madrid badges is the logo. <laughs> okay, uh, Mexico, Ryan Brown, Eritrea, uh, number four, and Czech is, uh, well, Czech Republic is Czech Bull. So yeah, there's your entries. I decided to follow Sierra Leone because that was quite an interesting entry, I thought, for this time time round. We've got a few big teams and a few little teams. I'm hoping the little teams would do better than last time. I can't remember who won. Oh, it was Serbia who won the last World Cup. So still a surprise um, winner for sure. But yeah, let's see if we can try and get like a one-star winner before the Halloween one, maybe. Because the Halloween one's going to be one-star teams anyway, so it won't be unexpected. Okay, Sierra Leone's first match is uh, all African affair. It's against Kenya, so let's get into this then. Let's see if Sierra Leone can beat Kenya. You all know who you are. I don't have to say your names again until the end. Okay, let's have a look. Uh, it was a nil-nil draw. Um, quite an uneventful affair then. Okay, so we've got Sierra Leone versus Mali. That's another all African um, standoff there. This this group, maybe all African, maybe, I don't know. No, it's not. <laughs> okay, let's, um, oh, Sierra Leone picked up a 1-0 win against Mali. So they got four points. That's very impressive, considering Mali is a little bit better than Sierra, Sierra Leone. 
Okay, now their next match is against New Zealand, who are in fourth. Um, so we'll check the groups after this match if Sierra Leone actually do finish. It's quite, it's going to be a tight group because I imagine there's only a few points in it. Let's have a look then. Okay, so it was nil-nil draw, so Sierra Leone actually got through on that one. Let's have a look and see what the groups say. Okay, so Group A, we have Russia and Turkey going through. Portugal, surprisingly, going out in that one. Um, group B, Scotland and Chad going through in that one. Curacao almost going through on goal difference there. Group C, Germany got dumped out by Greece and Ghana. So the big boys are falling at the race side at the moment. Um, Greece and Ghana going through in Group C. Group D, we have Spain going through, as usual. Paraguay going through as well. United Arab Emirates, not, uh, so close, but so far at the same time. Group E, United States dominate that one. And Colombia just in behind that one. Group F, we have Argentina going through. Nigeria as well. The Netherlands get dumped out. That's another Titan gone. Um, so, and the Euro and Euro sorry, Uruguay as well. That's incredible. Group G, we have Kenya and Sierra Leone, the two weakest teams probably in that group going through. And we also have in Group H, Poland and the Czech Republic sharing the same amount of points. Mexico and Eritrea going out. So a lot of the big teams have fallen out. So this is what the round of 16 looks like. We've got Russia versus Romania, Greece versus Paraguay, Scotland versus Turkey, Spain versus Ghana. USA versus Nigeria, Kenya versus Czech Republic, Argentina versus Colombia, that would be a good match, and Poland versus Sierra Leone. I think this is where it ends for Sierra Leone, possibly. Um, I don't know, we'll find out. Um, Sierra Leone could be a shocker, or we could just be moving on with the same as Poland, you know, the same as usual. Let's see um, what happens. Okay, so yeah, Poland beaten 2 now. I saw it flash up on the screen for two, uh, two seconds. Um, if you want my prediction, who's going to win? I think Spain's going to win. They are quite a, they're quite an OP team on this game. Um, so yeah, let's see if um, I'm right. Spain are still in there. Not anymore. USA have won the World Cup against Turkey. Okay, that's quite surprising considering that um, you know Spain were in there, Germany are in there, Portugal are in there, Netherlands were in there as well. Turkey and the USA going to the final. So USA was a double entry, was Alan Smith and Michael Elu. So congratulations to you both. You won the Subscriber World Cup with the USA. Um, Turkey was represented by the name I can't pronounce properly, but I'm sorry, the Kuala Onlu. Is that how you say it, I think? You could tell me if I'm wrong or not. But yeah, congratulations to you as well. You come second. Let's advance the awards. Negredo got top goal scorer, um, Polish player got um, best player, and um, Akin Fifth got um, best goalkeeper. Okay, so let's have a look and see how it went down then, because this is important. Okay, so USA beat Nigeria 1 0, this is reading left down. Um, Czech Republic beat Kenya 3 2, that's unlucky for Kenya there. Russia beat Romania 2 0. Is that Romania? Or was that Chad? I don't actually know. Like, is it? Like, I, I don't actually know. I might be getting that wrong. Is that Romania or is that Chad? I, I don't, it, it's got to be Romania, right? Hang on. Let me have a look. What am I doing? What am I doing right now? Let's just go here. No, it was Chad. It was Chad. Romania got knocked out, so I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that. It was Chad. Sorry. I thought it was Romania. It, look, their flags are almost similar, apart from the colour difference on the blue. Come on, give me a break. <laughs> it was Chad, okay, Chad got knocked out by Russia, unlucky. Um, Greece beat Paraguay 3-2, and then um, USA beat Czech Republic 2-1, Russia beat Greece 2-0, uh, USA beat Russia on penalties 4-3, that would have been a good match in real life, um, and then USA went on to win the World Cup. Russia went on to be third, Russia was represented by Agela, Agelos Galaris. So well done to you, you've got a third place playoff there. And uh, fourth, Poland was that guy with the Real Madrid badge who I can't even pronounce his name, but I will put it on the screen anyway. So congratulations, you got fourth. So let's finish off this video then. Reading right down, you've got Argentina being Colombia, 
Poland beat Sierra Leone, we know that. Turkey beating Scotland 1-0. Spain smashing Ghana 5-0. Then Argentina losing against Colum um, Poland, sorry. Um, and then Turkey beating Spain 2-1. And then Turkey went on to be Poland 2-1 and they both went on to lose their respective final games. So that was your Subscriber World Cup for September. I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, get your entries in for the next one. Uh, the next one, obviously, is, like I said, on the 6th of October. Anybody you want, anybody you want, just get as many uh, entries as you can in because you want to build up momentum for this, uh, for this Halloween one where it's like one, two-star teams, maybe half-star teams, you know, stuff like that. Basically, no five-star teams allowed or four-star or for maybe three. Okay, so that's what I'm planning to do. So, like and subscribe if you did like this video. Keep it loco, and I'll see you again for the next video.